everyone, welcome back to Apparel Wings channels. I am Tina. There are some of our viewers uh, want to know about how to measure their clothes. So today we are going to learn about how to measure your clothes. First, let's learn about how to measure your pants. The first one is to measure the waist of the pants. To get the most accurate measurement of the pants waist, you have to lay your plant flat right on the desk and make it as flat as possible. Do not stretch your pants, that will make a inaccurate measurement. Measure flat across the back waistband from one corner to another. This one is about 14 inches. And then double the number to get the extra waist size. The second one is to measure your front rise. To measure the front rise of your pants, start it at the bottom center of the crush seam which is right here and measure up to the top of the waistband right here this one is about 11 inches Rises is usually range from 7 inches to 12 inches after you get that you can flip your pants and measure the back It is almost the same as the front one, but the back, you have to start it from here. You have to find it in the front, measure start it from here, and then measure up until the waist length. This one is about 14 inches. The third one is to measure the hips. The most important thing is to define where the hip is. Some people they will measure across the pants at the base of the zipper, which is right here. So if you measure started from the base of the zipper, make sure that it's at the end of the edges, which is starting from here to here. This one is about 17.8 inches. But usually we measure from 20 centimeter below the waist, which is starting from here. Let's switch it to centimeter. Which started from here to here. And then it is uh, very similar, the waist. This one is also about 17.8 inches. Double the number to get the whole measurement. The fourth one is to measure your inseam and outseam. Starting from the crotch, where the piece of fabric in your pants intersect, which is right here. And draw the measurement tape down to the inside of the one leg, to the bottom of the leg. This one is about 31.5 inches. And then let's measure the outseam, which started from the Waistband, which is right here, to the end of your pants. This one is about 41.5 inches. The last step is to measure the leg opening. Slightly flip your pants and then press your pants. Measure the width of the bottom of your leg opening. This one is about 6 inches. After measuring your pants, some people want to know how to measure a t-shirt as well. So now let's learn about how to measure your t-shirt. In order to have the most accurate measurement, first, you have to have a tape with you. And then you have to lay your t-shirt on a flat surface like this. Make sure that there's no wrinkles on your t-shirt. There are a total of six measurements to measure a t-shirt. The first one is to measure the sleeve length, which is measure the high shoulder point, which is right here to the end of the shoulder. 
This one is about 16 inches. The second one is to measure the arm hold, which is measure the end of the shoulder, which is right here, to the end of the sleeve. This one is about 8 inches. The third one is to measure the chest. Place the tape close under the arms, which is right here. And make sure that the tape is flat across the whole shirt. This one is about 22 inches. The fourth one is to measure the hem. To measure the hem, we measure from one side to another. This is about 23.5 inches. The fifth one is to measure the front length. There are two ways to measure the front length. One is you start it from the lowest point of the neck, which is right here. Some of our customers, when they measure the front length, they start it from here. But please remember, the right way to measure the front length is to start it from here, and then make sure you across the whole shirt to the end of the hem which is right here. This one is 26.5 inches. The second way is you start it from the high shoulder point, which is right here. And then across the whole shirt to the end of the hem. This one is about 30.5 inches. The sixth one, which is the last measurement, is to measure our back length. To measure our back length, you have to start it at the central point of the neck, which is right here, and across the whole shirt to the end of the hem. This one is about 30 inches. So that's all for today. I hope you have a better understanding of how to measure your clothes. If you have any question or comment, you can comment below or send us a message. Please remember to keep subscribing our YouTube channel, and I will see you next time. Bye.